Hello YouTubers in the world, welcome to MSW Weekly Update, the better update, because Clinic's not here. And uh, I have some uh, people here, that it looks like they're sleeping or something. Uh, hey. Psst. Oh hey uh, man, hey, how you doing? Hey, hey, what's up? Yo Dex, oh, wake what up man. Dude, oh. what's going on? Oh. That was a long flight, man. <laughs> Dude, Ladies and gentlemen, Derek we're, Knight we're and the kids. House, man. Why are we upstairs? I thought we were on we're the jet. We're not going to Vegas, dude. How many times do I have to tell you? You need to stop drinking, you alcoholic. I didn't drink last night. Oh, oh last night. Last night was this exception, so you decided just to sleep all day? Uh, yeah. Whatever. I'm sorry, you were saying something. Yeah, yeah, oh, what's going on, yeah. dude? Well, well, you know, this is the uh, MSW Weekly Update. Oh, thank you. Thank you for having us aboard. Yeah, Appreciate yeah. You. What's oh, up, yeah. Darryl? What's up, you two? Yo, act like yo. Wasn't like y'all didn't know. I have, I have a terrible. Dude, look, it was hard. It's it's hard to keep track of him. Look, it was it was a rough night, man. Go ahead, go ahead, dog. Do what you do. So saying, I got my diet coat. You know, I'm all ready to go. So everyone loves Dr Pepper. Actually, everyone loves Coke. Yeah, right. So all right, well, attitude 2013 was the last show. If you didn't watch it, please check that show out. We're gonna run it down. Tell you how we thought about it, and that's the way it's gonna go. That's and that's how it is because I'm butterfinger fashion, diet coke fashion, diet coke criminal. Is nasty. Diet coke is amazing. Don't don't don't, don't stop it, Sean, man. Don't yeah, come on, man. Don't I'm good. here. I'm the host. Don't knock on the balls. Do whatever you want. Right? Yeah, you can do whatever you want. All right. So the the first match of uh, of attitude to attitude to thirteen oh, coke. All right. Attitude 2013 was the triple threat match with Derek Knight the Kid and Ozzy Lyons. Uh, since y'all were in the match, tell me what the hell went on, bro. Derek, I would like for you to go first on this one. That should be the only match that you watch. I mean, you got the Phenomenal Angels and Ozzy Lyons. You got three of the best wrestlers in the dude, ring. Dude, come closer, man. All in one. Yeah, dude, why are you so far? Quit being antisocial. You have three of the best wrestlers in the ring. At the same time, that's the bet. That that match was, that match stole the show, in my honest opinion. Um, I can honestly say, uh, through humble beginnings, uh, I really felt that that match. Uh, it felt like we were we were starting over again. Like we were just felt like we had that that rush that we needed, but at the same time, the match was very paced. It was very beautifully thought out, and there were some good spots in the match as well. Um, Dude. But a good, it was a great uh, overall, yeah. great chemistry, um, great psychology. It, was, it, was, it ran pretty well. It was a good match. Yeah, you, and you know, like, I look at y'all right now, and you know, it's so cool to see that y'all two and Ozzy go uh, at it, and at the end of the match, I'm still able to get up and shake hands and walk out as friends. That That's always oh, a great except thing to, to me. Well, I kind of just walked out. And just, yeah, well, yeah. It's just I, well, the thing you was, me I, in the face. I was no, I was no disrespect to these guys. I mean, I love these guys. You yeah. know? It's just when it comes down to business, it comes down to business, and I just had to recollect my thoughts and just take a breather and slow down and realize that you know, whoo, 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 I won. You know, you and kicked just, me in the face and said it was over, you dick. <laughs> Because it was over. Because I mean, it was just it was there, and it was the designated for your your face, and you took it. I'm sorry, you miscalculated. Yeah. You you messed up. I'm sorry. Touche. Touche. Well, in the end, Derek Knight rules victorious. Walks out, does a little Derek Knight thing that he does. Blah blah blah. Ozzy leaves it's with a special. bloody nose. Yeah, and, dude. Ozzy's uh, nose is all jacked. It was well, awesome. I mean, it takes it. It takes a good toll to knock that dude down and keep him down. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And it worked. But he, uh, but he, he got back up though. He, he got, he, he did he get back up. Uh, I do commend Ozzy. Some intention to keep it going. It a lot of heart. Uh, the next match uh, that took place was a MSW World Television Championship match. Uh, I uh, took it upon myself as a GM to make that match a non-disqualification match. Right. So that means that tables, chairs, whatever, ev everything went. It was so a it was uh, me and Aaron Wright. Oh right. Went to that match. How did y'all feel about that match? Um, honestly, uh, I just I knew it was bound to happen because of the. The friendship show had prior to wrestling, so it was just, it was kind of remarkable because it's, it's something nice to see, you know, something besides Derek and yeah. I unfold right in front of us, a true friendship, and 
you know, I, I commend Aaron at both of y'all because y'all y'all actually brought some tables in and some some damage was done. You know, some I mean, damage was done. Some damage yeah, was done. Y'all did. Y'all did. Awesome. Y'all brought a good. Y'all brought a good match yeah, to the table. I, I, cool. I just want to say I appreciate you know you actually. Y'all actually are starting to pay attention and stuff, man. Praise and Jesus. It's good. Praise and Jesus. And it's good because, dude, yeah. can't do it forever, man. Yeah. No, hey, man. And, and, you know, after what I did to Aaron Rod in that match and all, and, you know, the, the chair hits and putting him through That's a right. piece of plywood, he rose up. He didn't he, break uh, till the second time. Choke, choke yeah, slam, that. double choke slam, had the Rod shoot, and he stunned me on the ground, one, two, three. I know. And, he, you know. He had that. that that pure intensity. Yeah, that was and as time. much as you know, I I didn't like the guy because the fact that you know he had the balls come face me, and uh, tell me what's up. You know, I respect that. I had to give him his yeah, respect. You, gotta, you, you know? gotta, you gotta give that's him just, man that's 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 the best thing to do. That's that's the manly thing to do. He's, he's, he's that that key word of tonight's segment, folks, is the word manly. manly. What is the manly thing to do, and what is not the so manly? Every time the what word would be the manly bitch comes thing up, do? we'll do the peewee playhouse. Manly. manly. Ah. I don't think it's that dramatic. Word of the day. But, uh, yeah. The, 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 yeah. What's next? What's next? Oh, well, hold on, we didn't say how it Oh, oh, oh Aaron Wright won. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, um, he did. You know, I gave him his respects, and then Lawrence Alfred and Darren Knight come out oh. to the ring. We yeah, did. that was you. That's right. Lawrence Alfred decides there. to take the mic and go off on me and him, and apparently give us a name. I thought y'all came up with the name. Huh? No. They didn't. didn't. I thought they did. And the name no, is? Didn't. Yeah, da what's the name? Damage Inc. Damage Inc. So we have two teams that, are, that have the word incorporated in it. Hey, it's not my fault. I didn't do nothing. Damage Inc. is better. It's, what? Uh, I didn't do nothing. Who said that? I mean, I mean, what, what sounds like more majestic and more like an honoring, appealing? Advocate Incorporated, Damage Incorporated, or the Phenomenal Angels. You think about it. Phenomenal, phenomenal and Angels. angels. It's like God's talking to us. Damn. God does I have a cell phone call. Can you Wait. please excuse me for a second? You got that? Oh. <laughs> Hello. How's it going? You're on the uh, Mid South Wrestling Weekly Update. How you doing? I know, Where's right? My phone? Go I'll my just phone. go ahead and uh, move it along here. Um, the uh, third no, match really. inside, inside the MSW. Right? Yeah, but... No. I think it's down there. Attitude 2013. Damn, y'all talking about the show, bro. No. Yeah, we're making your show better. Dude, we are making the show. <laughs> making the show better, okay? So, carry on. So, anyway, we got the third match coming up uh, with... It was Kung Fu Jack and Barabbas. Oof. Somebody uh, all, over all, here. All, all I could say is... Uh, <laughs> Kung Fu did a little bit of ass whipping. A yeah, little, well, little bit of... Kung Fu it, punched the it, fuck this out is, of him. This is, how, this is how I saw this match, alright? Kung Fu Jack... And Barabbas. It reminded me of Barabbas is Kung Fu Jack is son. Barabbas came home with some bad grades. He Kung did. Fu Jack didn't like too much. Drank a little bit too much beer. And guess what happened? He did a good old fashioned ass. Hey, yeah. Plain and simple. We don't even have to describe the match, but besides, I'm an ass with it. Yeah, but that's what it was. That's basically. Uncle Kung Fu Jack was drunk out of his mind with his Budweiser. Yeah. God only knows what else he was on. That wow. That Superman punch was crazy. But that Superman punch knocked that kid the Wow. Fuck. Go to sleep, bitch. That's exactly what happened. Man of alcohol he, with a Superman yeah, punch. Yeah, he did it twice. Twice. Oh, he did do it twice. He did do it twice. He had to because that little fucker won't. He'll get up, man. He's crazy. He's not crazy. He's a he? what he's kind of submission name? specialist. What is he like? He is well, the man. Well, don't. We'll try the not, man. Try, oh, please. The best in the business. Try, Dude, try not to, to uh, talk much about him. Just a sec, kid. I'll, I'll, I'll get to you in a sec. But Kung Fu Jack uh, goes over in that match, which I liked. He won. I have no. Look at him. Look at him. It's the MSW Weekly update. We don't give a fuck. I found my phone. I'm happy for it. Oh, okay. So <laughs> Kung Fu Jack wins that match. Thank God, I hate that little dude, man. They hung up. I hate Barabbas. He's just like, he's like that, that ant that like crawls inside your pants and I you found it. You, but you can't find him. You can't. He's like, like my he's like, I'm, I'm serious. I didn't know. I'm dancing. I'm dancing. I'm he's smiling all the time. He just wants to smack you a little bit, you know. So, we talk so, a little bit, you know. So Kung Can Fu you Jack you? wins and uh, walks Kudos out. Kudos to Kung Fu Jack. Kudos to Kung Fu Jack. Kung Fu Jack pushed the shit out of him. And then right after that, there was a uh, little thingy. Uh, was it locked up with the law? Oh, oh yeah. that, yeah, locked up with the law. 
Was it locked up? Was yeah, it was locked up. Hold on, let me check my, uh... It's more like Brad has peed on himself. Yeah. Hold on, I have to... Cam cameraman, can you, uh, tell me what, what was next after that? I believe it was locked up with the law. It was locked up with the law, so, uh, don't question my methods. Oh. Nigga, we said it was locked up don't with the law. No. Oh, so I question my methods. I, I, uh, I'm just confused. I'm just a guy in the metal hair just listening. Dude, kid. <sighs> Break it down, bro. What the hell? Okay. So, let's, let's set the record straight for Kid and Barabbas, okay? Barabbas is nothing more than a joke. Nothing more than a little bitch. Nothing more than a footnote. Who's going to go down in the history of the kid's career as another ass that I have kicked. But, let's let's give credit where credit is due. Uh, Barabbas does have some potential. I mean, some. Okay. Mm. Some potential. Uh, what he really, what he really lacks... Yeah, I said it in the segment that he doesn't give a shit. And that's that's one of the things that kind of pisses me off. But what I really want to see with Barabbas is I want to see if Barabbas can bring his game to the table against one of the Hall of Famers. And, and, and you, you know what else Barabbas could possibly do? What could he do? He could really stop running his damn mouth so much because he talks a lot. But the problem is he talks shit and he can't back it up. I don't know, man. He's, he's got a little, he's got a quite a bit of a, a good submission going on there for him. Dude, he's one dimension. You sure? I, I just, but you see, you gotta look at the light in people. You're looking at all the negative, man. Dude, I'm gonna kick his ass when we meet in the ring. Yeah, but it might, it's just like all the veterans that have taught us, you have to know one thing and one thing only. Don't ever... Take advantage of your opponent. Oh, you know, no, you're supposed never. to know that. Never. I do it's know that. It's simple. So Let, basically... Basically, Barabbas' light at the end of the tunnel is me not only A, beating the shit out of him, but B, beating him at his own game. Because apparently, our match is a submission match. Which is supposedly in his world, right? Right. But see, this is the funny thing. Barabbas doesn't seem to realize yeah, Barabbas has got his jujitsu, but that's only gonna take him so far. All that fancy shit, that's not gonna work. Okay? The kid grappled with the best of them for four years. This one right here. Oh. We used to go back and forth. <laughs> we grappled together for four years, alright? So kids, the kid's got a ground game. Whether or not Barabbas wants to believe it, but you see, the kid's got more than a ground game. The kid will beat the shit out of him. And after I'm done beating the shit out of him, I might fuck him over and put him in one of his little fancy holds. What? And then just watch him tap out. What? It's, that's that's it. That's Barabbas' light at the end of the tunnel. Him tapping out. So it's pretty much you're going to make him tap out. I'm going to make him tap out. Yeah, I will beat Barabbas beautiful. at that's his wonderful. own game. What's next on the card? <laughs> yeah, what's next, like, please? I'm hearing him talk about right. how much he's going to beat Barabbas. Well, I'm, right. I'm, I'm, I'm going to let it. you know. I, 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 I love no, it. don't be afraid to cut me off shit. But, uh, hey, man, shut up. For uh, the fourth people. match uh, was actually a match that I planned with some people decided to... Nicker and Bicker. Oh. Advocate Inc. What? Advocate Inc. What? I said Advocate fucking Inc. Who? What? What? And uh, that's the bottom there's line. A, there's a lot of what's in this. And, uh, I know, that was confusing. Yeah, so Advocate Inc. wants to talk shit, and then y'all decide to jump in because, let's just say it, if somebody's going to put your name in something, there's no talking bad about you, you really think you're going to step back? Just let it happen? Hell no. Uh, no. No, so y'all go in there. Exactly. And uh, being the good GM that I am, I decided to make a match. Phenomenal Angels versus Advocate Inc. Millions and millions of bucks made on that match. Yeah? So yeah, when do I get the cut? What? <laughs> I'm still waiting for that check to come in. The purchase will be coming in soon. You need to expedite that shit. <laughs> well, but, uh... Yeah, dude, y'all are like almost in every match. Like, y'all can just talk about everything. I might as well just let y'all be the host of the uh, show. No, nah, man, we wouldn't want to take that spotlight. Nah, dude, you, you host the show, the criminal, dog. Man. You are the criminal. Come on, criminal. Phenomenal Angels versus Advocate. Well, let's just say something. You know, Advocate Inc. had uh, something to say about Damage Inc., I guess is what we call Damage Inc., me and Aaron. 
they had something to say. I didn't like it. One bit. Yeah, so, but does anybody uh, ever like anything that they say? Uh, I know a perfect way for us to explain this. We can break it down in the mathematical equation. Okay, so what is the Y? So the Y... Well, Why we're back uh, because the cameraman decided to uh, be technically be difficult. We were, we were on the tag team match, right? We were on the tag team match. Ah, so yes, we can break oh, we can we can break it down like this. Okay, we had the Y, okay, which so was the ring itself. Was the ring itself? Well, just to plus, verify, we've got the ring. Yes. Plus, have it incorporated. So yep. for them. We are going to draw two stick beaches. <laughs> I love going through school time. Okay, so what is next? The next thing is phenomenal angels. Oh, okay. We have Plus, our halo and everything being dropped down. Okay, so for, for the phenomenal angels, we are going to draw a shining light and two of the most manly men you have ever seen. Beautiful. Okay, so here is the light. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Light, manly men. But logically, when you think about this, this is the whole reason why the phenomenal angels are this. This much better than. Wait. Do that corporate. again. This much. Okay. This much. This much. But better. higher. But but a lot higher. But the reason why is because we know psychology. We have natural wrestling ability. Mm -hmm. We have an amateur wrestling the background. Kick at the jungle. We're in the Hall of Fame. Mm -hmm. Two former GWA champions. Yeah. Two what? former Mid South Wrestling champions. Why? Hold every pretty much every belt in Mid South Wrestling. Why? Hold a belt. We each hold a belt in AW. I mean in uh, UWA. Yep. Yeah. Why? 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 Tag team of the decade. Why? Yeah. The list goes on and on. And that's the bottom. Bottom line, right? Look, guys. Advocate Incorporated. I don't disrespect you. You're ranting, advocate. You're having a self-esteem problem. I don't know if you're a woman or if you're a man. I can't he, really tell. He, he really looks like Johnny Cage. Oh, just, just because I slept with your girlfriend, ex-girlfriend, it doesn't, oh. you know, it doesn't mean anything. Hey guy. You need to just... Hey guy. Hey guy. Well, that was personal. We can edit that, right? <laughs> no, I don't want you to edit it. It's fine. He needs oh. to understand. We're live. Oh. He, needs, he needs to understand. We're live. He needs to understand that even. He needs I, to quit being a bitch. I'm breaking his pride and joy when it comes oh. to the sex game as well. He's my pride and joy. Is that joy. what it is? Is that what it is? That's, that what it is? that's why he's mad at me because he wishes he was me. But he's not me. I'm no, the good not. looking one of the company. I'm wow. sorry. I'm so he's jealous because you're a man whore. And we were talking about the tag team match and, and then we went to Derek Knight Schlong. <laughs> No, that's why the tag team match was even preceded in the first place, because he's mad because he's butthurt because I slept with his ex-girlfriend. Yo, he really is butthurt. Don't you get it? Are you putting the pieces Trending. together and Terrace is there to be like, yeah, I'm going to make sure it happens because of you. I think Terrace mm -hmm. got Down Syndrome. So we got a Down Syndrome Justin Bieber guy. And it's just... Justin <laughs> Syndrome. Justin Syndrome. Bieber. Bieber Syndrome. Bieber Country. I do Bieber. understand... Like, if y'all think back, like, no one won that match, right? No one did. But, no one did. But it doesn't matter, because we'll win. Okay. Do we, right. So technically, I'm, isn't that I'm, match still going on? Yeah, that match is going on forever. Okay, so when Bieber Syndrome walks through the door, it's on. We'll beat the shit out of him, and the Phenomenal Angels will win. Okay, cool. cool. So anyways, what's next? Well, see, the thing was is that, you know, it, it, it uh, y'all went to a brawl. The match was called. Me and Lawrence had to come out and uh, break you up. And you have a match with Mr. Terror at the next show at Mid South Mania. I do. And you have a match with the Advocate Who? at the next show. The Advocate. Who? The Advocate. That guy. What? Johnny Cage? The guy that can't beat Lawrence up. <laughs> oh. And the guy that got beat by Quinning. <gasps> Oh. It sucks to lose against that thing. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. I hate the guy. And the guy who never beat Aaron Wright. <laughs> so he lost. So he can't win against Lawrence. He can't. He lost, he lost against the clinic. clinic and Didn't he lose to Aaron Wright? And yes, he, he lost did. his girlfriend to you. Or something like that. The guy's having some In issues. Some way. I heard he's got a drinking problem, too. I ain't gonna lie. I'd be depressed if I was advocate. I, I wonder what him and Tara do together at night. Do they spoon together? Or? Bieber syndrome, dude. Bieber syndrome. <laughs> Right, man. He's just mad because it's... Well, he would, like, terror, terror, size, and advocate being, like,
kind of short, who but he's like skin on like. Top what, and what on who pitches and who catches? Him? Like, would he would Terry just grab him and just use him as a like a plunger on his dick? Yeah, yeah. You know. Penetrate, penetrate, penetrate. That's all you would see. Welcome Ask to it. sex talk with criminals. <laughs> Might as well be. But anyway, so I those matches are that. coming soon in Mid South Mania, which is going to be coming this month on the seventeenth. Live on pay per view, for free. So it's for not free. really pay. But didn't you uh, go on one in Mid South Mania? We sure did. Yeah, we sure did. You didn't we have a match of the year? Yeah, and didn't you beat me, you son of a bitch? I did hmm. beat you that time. Your time's coming, kid. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Your time's coming. So then. Your time's coming. Me, looking off in the, the criminal, and Ozzy Lyons go at it one on one for the MSW World you know, Heavyweight Ozzie, Championship. You know, Ozzy did say earlier. I, I remember going back and watching through the videos, and he said he was going to redeem himself. He redeemed himself because I believe he uh, didn't he, uh, he won right. Yeah, he won. Hey, did so, he? So, so where does you that lose lose? twice Ouch. on that day? Hmm. Not, not so, that's not, not good, so. dude. I lost twice. In the same match? In the same, same show. Day. Same show. At the same venue. The same damn time. Damn. Mm -mm. It's so like, mania. It's right around the corner, guys. Dude, you need to get your shit together. Maybe trim your beard, maybe? And yeah. Get, Ooh, some that, is, that is a pretty good idea. Drink less Diet Coke. some weights. Bro. <laughs> Dude, that's 20 ounces. Maybe, maybe watch some <laughs> film. Dude, pussies live 20 ounces. Come on, zero my calories. My four-year-old sister can live 20 ounces. So we put that to the test. Four. I mean, I mean, if y'all really want to go like that, then, ladies and gentlemen, the criminal outside the wrestling world is a carpenter. And if you ever seen a rafter, which is a two by eight, I have carried four Moving on. 20 <laughs> foot long on this shoulder. This guy. You know how much one one weighs? No, what? I don't know, but it weighs a lot. Was he talking but about I'm something? So back to the point. <laughs> back to, back the, to the, the point. Wrestling. I lost two times in that show. You I lost sure did. to you terrible. Ozzy, I, you see, <laughs> it's like But me and uh, Ozzy's match, we put on a good show. Y'all did. It was it a good match. It was a good. Put on a good, very good match. Yeah, it really was. It was good. You lost. You did what you had to do. I commend you for it. Hey, and there's... Everyone loses. There can always be yeah. a second chance coming. Maybe yeah. I just have to train some more. I'm not y'all, damn it. Start lifting 24-ounce bottles. <sighs> I don't know about that. So, uh... <laughs> yeah. So, the last match is, uh... Lawrence Alfred. The main event, Lawrence Alfred versus Aaron Ryan. This mm. is when the shit starts to... I believe uh, Aaron Ryan did his job, you know, with controlling the pace quite a bit throughout the match. Yeah. He, he, everything ran pretty, you know, smoothly, but he he, I never ran thought this into team. the ref. Yeah. Right. But see, that Not was the, the weird thing, because the ref was so on edge, like, even from, even from the jump, it seemed like they was gunning for the ref. You mm. know? Um... Oh, but overall, good match, but what happened afterwards, and I don't think nobody saw that coming. Afterwards, uh, Lawrence Alfred uh, got attacked yeah. by Avakink. Avakink came out and decided shit. to just Fuzzy destroy Lawrence. La 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 <sighs> they left. Um, if, if they didn't like the guy, all they had to do was have a conversation with him. Really? Like, we can't I be mean, adults anymore? I don't understand Who the why they would do a dirty tactic like that. African Inc. would do that. The Phenomenal Angels would never do such a thing. But I'm a friendly person, and I don't think people should do that to each other. That's fucked up. I mean, Mouth fart. They're not what very... Like, I, guess, I guess what I said is true. They're not very friendly, are they? Would we ever do that? I guess they're not. That's why I had the sickest girlfriend. Would we ever sneak at those people? <laughs> I just couldn't help myself. Really? She threw herself at me like a platter. And just, I had to... Did you do the dishes? <laughs> I did the dishes. I did the dishes. Right on. Anyway. All right. Well, and then um, after that went down, Lawrence Alfred got up, and he threw all his belts down. He threw the GWA belt down and put the tag team belts on y'all. And uh, Lawrence Alfred walked out of the GWA. Hmm. Tag team champions, right? That's us. That's us. 
Oh, who would have thought we'd end up in this position? These guys. So what do you say? What do you say we run the belts until what? I mean, I don't leave until the end of the year. Yeah, I guess we could do that. What do you say? We run the belts? Damage. Hey, fucktard. The host of the show? Damage who? This fucktard. Damage who? Damage Inc. I'm sorry, who? Has a match with y'all as itself mania. Who? I don't understand your language that you're speaking right now. I don't speak dumbass. Go Spanish. I mean, this damage incorporated. I understand the whole beer thing and the whole, yeah, I'm a hockey player, but I don't understand it. I just, it kind of it kind of makes me want to throw up a little bit. But I don't speak bitch. So. But, I, but I'll give you this. You are better than average. I mean, I don't speak yeah, 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 everyone so. hates those guys. Yeah, but I don't, I don't hate you as much. In fact, I don't have anything against you. I think you're actually a great person. I think you could actually. Wrestling wise, I, I, can't, I can't be your friend. I think you they can't could be my friend. I don't want to be your friend. I think they could actually you have, have a good karma. match with us. I see your aura, and it's not a very, very pretty. It's color. very, very red. Is it because of di diet coke thing? It's very toxic. <laughs> it's because of the diet coke. Man's drink. Man's drink. You right know, if we're not at the show, you know what? I'll take you out to dinner. And we'll have a great time. You'll have plenty of diet cokes. But at the show, I can't be your friend. At the show, oh. I'll beat the shit out of you. Okay. After I'm, the show. I'm glad we so we can buy show. a hotel room, shut the lights off. None of that. No, no one know. No, not that far. No, no. no. Okay. maybe you two, but for me, it's it's me and my. I don't know how you and Damage Incorporated work when it comes to that buddy system. Okay. That's up to y'all. Yeah. We're men. Yeah, no, damn no, it. We don't. We don't. We don't do that. Yeah, no. America. Oh, well, I mean, you're not a man until you take a dick up the ass. No, uh, no I'm you're, glad, you're I'm a glad man. You think that. You're a man <laughs> if you don't take the dick up the ass. I mean, that's oh, so oh, you're, then somebody told me when you the take the way. dick up the ass, you're not a man anymore. You lost your rights. You're a woman. Oh, okay. So, uh, so how does that work between you two? Since both of y'all speak bitch, both oh. of y'all aren't really that great in the ring. Well, I mean, I mean how does it work for y'all that y'all both speak asshole when I can't speak asshole? Wait, wait. First wait. of all, he's the one that speaks the asshole. I'm he's the right. Of, I'm the sentimental one. Don't get it twisted. Oh. I'm just trying oh. to be nice to you. This okay. guy's just... Okay. See, we don't both speak asshole. He's just blabbering. I speak asshole. He don't. He's too nice to speak asshole. That's why when it comes down to the ring... We just win because I bring the intensity. I kick the shit out of them. They you. might win. They're not gonna win. Maybe when I'm like eighty five. He doesn't have faith in people. Maybe when I'm eighty five and I can't fucking wrestle anymore. He just thinks he's God. I am God's gift to wrestling. <laughs> anyway, okay. anyway. Okay, see you, Punk. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, that was the MSW <laughs> weekly update. We will see y'all next oh, week. Wait, what? I forgot one thing. What? The GWA championship. It's vacant right now. It is vacant. What's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? We should put it on the kid. The Mr. GWA Kermel. championship right now is vacant. vacant. It's like locked away. But it's being. Is it at Fort it's Knox? Being it's, right being, now. it's being held. It's being. It, it it's, is it's in being Fort observed. Knox. I thought so. Cabinet B, slot two. Do you know where that is? Why'd board, you tell him? The board. <laughs> the board. The board is definitely watching over it right now, yeah. and discussing terms of what is gonna actually. But I put faith. In there. I, I have faith in the board as well. Have you have you heard anything from the board? I mean, this, this is serious business, you know. No. Yeah. Yeah. That was the MSW Weekly Update. We'll see y'all next time at uh, Mid South Mania, which will be on the seventeenth. If any of y'all want to come, just don't forget to uh, message us uh, on the Facebook. We Facebook. GWA, Twitter, what? MSW, what? Computer, what? Internet. We have a Twitter. Yeah. We do have a. Wait, do we have a Twitter? Yes, we do. We have a Twitter. We do. Uh, yes. Twitter. I'll show you later. Tweet us. Oh, and before we go, Advocate, I hope you don't have any hard feelings towards me because. Because you suck. <laughs> well, just to make things things worse, I had a round with that girl too. Uh, so anyway, see y'all <laughs> next week at Mid South Mania. Wait, that's fucked up. What? Y'all both went rounds with this bro. Oh, wait, I'm in a relationship, so it's okay. Later.